The recovery from azoospermia using prolostem treatment highly depends on the number of spermatogonial stem cells located inside the testes. Many of us still believe that in Sertoli cell only syndrome, there is a complete absence of stem cells. In 2010, a team of researchers published a study showing that Sertoli cell only syndrome also has spermatogonial stem cells that can be isolated and culture in the lab. We will explain this research later in the different presentation. This section is from Sertoli cell only syndrome. In high magnification, special fixation and staining, we can locate spermatogonial stem cells as you can see. In animal models, we found that high radiation doses kill more stem cells and this affects the recovery of the sperm production. This figure, showing many data from our experiments, we will simplify the data by focusing on this figure. The dashed line showing the recovery of the rats after the radiation. We found a coloration between the number of spermatogonial stem cell and the recovery process. The more stem cells found inside the testes increases the recovery process. Based on these animal models, we learned that a low number of stem cells in azoospermia cases increase the recovery period after treatment and lower success rates, while in cases of a high number of stem cells inside the testes reduce the recovery period and increase the success chances of finding sperm after treatment. Please find more about Prolistem by visiting our official site, prolistem.com.